Hey everybody, George here, real life of a foodie. I'm not being dramatic. I am really that frickin' cold. Yeah, got gloves, I got sweatshirts, long sleeves, and now I got thermals. I got uh, uh, <clears throat> a lovely fleece-lined coat on, I've got a beanie on. Yeah, extra socks, warm shoes. That's the biggest thing. Uh, I'm cold all the damn time. I was the sweaty guy that was always wearing flip-flops and shorts, tank tops, and still sweaty. I mean, a lot of it had to do with blood sugar and such. But um, most of the time, it's just being fat. You know, um, when you're when you're overweight, you have a tendency to uh, be huffing and puffing quite a bit more. Well, now I'm not huffing and puffing quite as much. Uh, I'm down to 271 now, actually 271.2. Uh, blood pressure remains 63 BPM. Uh, whether I'm resting or not, really, it gets up to around 75. But uh, yeah, it's pretty low, my blood pressure. Uh, last one I checked was 123 over 74. And yeah, uh, blood sugars are consistently about the 90s and have gotten as high as 121 the last two weeks. Uh, so let's see, today is the 7th of January, I think. So yeah, just, wow, okay. <laughs> Different, certainly much colder. Uh, starting to feel a little bit better about myself, starting to get over the cold and stuff. I always get sick right around, uh, right around my birthday. It's uh, around, um, Thanksgiving and still trying to get over it a month and a half later but uh, yeah um, what I'm hoping for for everybody is just hope that I remember there's hope if you're an overeater like me uh, the biggest hope that I found was my hunger was gone uh, I really had to force myself to eat and uh, yeah kind of screws up your mind a little bit anyway good to see you and uh, don't forget to thrive.